Welcome back everyone to Moons and Pearls. Luna and I are so happy to have you guys. Thank you all for your support. If you haven't already done so, make sure you like, share, and subscribe to join our channel. I'm here to do a bonus reading for Gemini. Gemini, you guys were um, my, <laughs> my group that had the most views, so I appreciate and love every single one of you guys. All of you guys, my cross watchers, welcome as well. I'm happy to have you guys. Um, and if you haven't already done so, make sure you subscribe. So let's see what do we have here in the current energy for Gemini. Magic. I feel like you are in an energy of experiencing manifestation firsthand. Um, and don't mind Luna's hair. She's um, she's due for for her. Um, beauty day soon but um you guys are again going into i see you guys writing things down more uh, especially with the full moon that we just had i feel like you've realized how powerful you are right now gemini um there's also a, a sense of you experiencing changes in your life a lot of changes happening in your life which can be a little scary um but I feel like you are very creative. Your energy is very, um, when I look at her, she has very clear eyes. So like you have a clear vision of what you want to create or what you want in your life. So rituals, wishes, prayers um, at this time are very useful for you. Um, let's see, one more for your general reading um if you haven't already done so make sure you subscribe so i know to come back and do these you guys um let's see here we have here challenge so there's something about this change that you're going through that can seem challenging to you i feel like gemini sorry you guys the candle's like really on fire here but there's there's a challenge here um that sometimes makes you feel unmotivated as well like uh, going through this change starting all over again energy but you are i think with these two cards at the end you're planning how to do this the right way and the way that's going to benefit you the most okay so let's see, Gemini, what's happened in the recent past, what's coming for you guys. Um, let's see. I don't know if you're changing jobs or just feeling like an unexpected change. Yep. See? The tower moment. So this tower moment, though, it doesn't feel like... It feels like it's for your highest good, like... um like i'm hearing out with the old and with the new so yeah but this is why I, I also feel like you're not wanting to be around a lot of people what is this spirit that we have i gemini i feel like wherever you were at um it wasn't your place it wasn't it was like you were around the wrong people the wrong crowd um and i feel like this was holding you back this was making you feel stagnant or making you feel like why am i having this much difficulty or why are these blockages happening um but this tower moment is happening to break open a new you to um the phoenix rising from the ashes is what i'm hearing so all this disappointments or destructions or things is to clear your path gemini for something way better and spirit does have an ace of cups here for you something is coming something that you've asked for something that you've prayed about is it's on its way um so in contrast i also feel like you're being moved to be around people that will be more supportive um, of your dreams of what you want yeah you're manifesting this 
you're praying about this you are and we had alchemists we had magic so this is what you're working on right now gemini on the right partnership on the right things to be around you in order for you to create this um i hear massive stability around you but there is um an emperor in reverse so there is someone around your energy that's been quite unstable and i feel like their energy destabilizes you like when you're trying to manifest tell me spirit about this emperor could be a capricorn could be someone that um has brought like a trauma bond or addictive patterns to your life um tell me more about this this energy around gemini I want to say like sway you from your dreams sway you from your potential and i don't know i don't like this energy um the reason why they're here right now why their energy is around you more is because you have been working so much on yourself you have been giving yourself a lot of love a lot of self-care um you have spent a lot of time in um investing in yourself and with this person sees that like it's all yellow it's all bright you're you're rebirthing yourself and it's like a glow to you so then this other energy i feel like was very deceptive hurt you in the past and i feel like okay fine i'm moving away from you and then they're looking back and thinking oh wow look at look at this person he or she wow look at them they look great um but there there are hidden motives there's there's things that this person is hiding what is this person hiding from my gemini what is this person hiding they're hiding the fact that they didn't want they didn't want it to end and that they know the truth that they didn't put the work in it they didn't they're they're hiding the fact that they miss you they're hiding emotions they're hiding the fact that they didn't want it to end they didn't want this whole situation to be done but i feel like there's been like a separation a breakup you've you've detached from this energy gemini or you're working on it but this person what they're hiding is their emotions they're hiding how they truly felt or feel about you um and they're having a lot of memories a lot of nostalgia but the thing is is that they're not taking any action really their their energy's there but i don't see them there i don't know if that makes sense to you guys guys make sure you like comment subscribe let me know if these messages resonate that way i know to come back and do these i i enjoy doing these readings you guys spirit tell me about this situation here no reconciliation so i don't know if this person wanted to or thought they could but i feel like when you wanted it it's codependent it's a codependent and i feel like this is an emotional codependent relationship um and now they see that you don't need them you never needed them and they they played a lot with with they manipulated a lot through your emotions, how you felt, pulled on your soft spots. But I feel like you wanted the reconciliation sooner, whereas now I don't see you, Gemini, very interested in this because you're so attracted. You are enjoying life right now. You are like living your life and enjoying the moments fully, fully. And you could be, very soon coming in contact with your real soulmate you're going to be in an energy of getting to know this person um i don't see this being your ex someone from the past but their energy is around okay just so you know so i want to do um of course the end of messages spirit what do we have here for gemini what should they know and I think I want to pull like a manifestation card since you guys are in that energy. Forgiveness, okay? Forgive others for yourself. 
and unlikely. If you're asking about the situation, the answer is unlikely. And remain positive. Continue on your bright energy, Gemini, because you're looking fabulous. And this forgiveness card is probably one of my favorite ones, um, you guys, because it's not for the weak. Forgiveness, when you truly forget with your forgive with your heart and your soul, you will feel the difference. It's more than, oh, I'm sorry. It's so much deeper than that. Um, forgiveness can work miracles when you release the past. A weight is lifted from your shoulders and a sense of freedom washes over you. Ask your angels to help you let go of sadness or pain caused by others so that you can be free. This card can also refer to a need for self-forgiveness. It's time to let go of any guilt you are holding onto regarding past mistakes you may have made. Give yourself credit for having tried your best even if the results weren't what you would have liked. Focus on the changes you've made since then that have made you a better person. And you are a better person. You are magnificent. Okay, you guys, let's see spirit. What's an abundance card for? Okay, we have my life has meaning and purpose. A life infused with meaning and purpose is a successful life. We have, I am free. We just talked about this to create success in my life it is my choice to be free is to know what i can direct my awareness where i want to when i want to and how i want to you guys this is beautiful so beautiful and we have my visions create my world i recognize my ability to transform the invisible into visible, the unmanifested into the manifest. You guys, this is so exciting. We just, just talked about how powerful your energy is right now, you guys. So I wish you guys all the best. Like, share, subscribe, come back. I'd love to have you guys. We'll see you soon. Ciao.